Okay, so we've had two types, penetrative and surrender. Now, the third one I've called recognition slash resting slash abiding. In order to rest or abide, we kind of need to have a recognition, more or less. You could rest without a recognition, and then the recognition could come. But typically, we're going to be resting our attention inside of a recognition of something. So recognition slash resting slash abiding. Those are more or less synonymous. This style of meditation has one recognize the presence of the true nature of reality slash consciousness to some degree. In between parentheses, the degree of purity slash clarity of one's recognition of the true nature of reality or consciousness usually depends on one's former penetrative experiences with recognition, penetration, or surrender. By this I mean when you're when you're recognizing awareness right now, it's typically going to be at, it's not going to go far beyond your level of prior recognition, right? That's where penetration comes in, penetrating deeper into purer levels of awareness, where there is less filtration of perception, where there is more naked, pure, just awareness, formless. The more you get used to the formlessness, the deeper or purer your recognition of the nature of reality will become. So the degree of recognition of the nature of reality will increase. Now, if you're going to be resting in that recognition, it's typically at the level that you're at. The farther you penetrate, doo -doo, little integration time, penetrating deeper. Whoa, holy fuck. Oh, what was that? Okay, kind of this, kind of that. Oh, Bettina talked about this. Oh, that's what that is. Ah, okay, I'm ready for more. Boop, a little higher, etc. right? So penetration, peak experiences, integration. Now the peak experience is integration. And that process is going to purify your ability to recognize the true I am, the true nature of yourself, of being, and ultimately even of the absolute reality beyond even being. But we'll get to that later, possibly. The point to be gotten here is that through penetrative meditation or surrender and or surrender meditation, one becomes purer in one's and more powerful in one's ability to recognize this ever-present formless I am, or beingness, or awareness, or the self, really. Awareness becoming aware of itself, the subject becoming aware of its own nature. So then you can start to rest in it, or abide in it, or maintain it, but it's not really a doership, it's not a willful maintaining it, although you could willfully maintain it, it's totally possible and can be beneficial too. But it's more like a resting, that's why I included resting in this. You want to simply rest, allow the recognition, be receptive for meditation, be receptive for the recognition of what's always already present, which doesn't have a form or a name. So you got to kind of stay subtle. So you're resting in the subtlety of your recognition of the fact that you exist, of the fact that something right now, life itself, in you, around you, as you, is hearing my voice without any effort. And by simply repeating that short moment of recognition many times, one begins to kind of abide in it. The concentration becomes a more steady stream of meditation. There's more of a powerful, continuous stream of recognition that begins to develop during your meditations. For instance, one recognizes with a certain degree of clarity Again, this depends on your prior practice. The ever-present nature of already present awareness, because awareness is already present, isn't it? You're already aware. It's not something you're doing. It's already aware. So the clarity or your recognition of that, or that subtle sense of I exist, and then one rests in the awareness of this truth of this recognition. One abides in the recognition. The dude abides. The dude, the person abides in surrender to God, in recognition of the whole. Movie reference. You could also say one maintains this recognition or repeats such a moment of recognition consecutively until it becomes a more naturally obvious 
thicker, more powerful, steady stream that one can really rest in, enjoy. It becomes more enjoyable, also soothing. There's this flow of awareness recognizing itself and it starts to feel like almost like thicker, like that thick oil. It feels suddenly the formless starts to develop a stronger presence. And you can therefore more easily rest in the presence because now it becomes almost like an object, something your mind can recognize and rest in, even though it's the emanation of the true self rather than an object. But still it becomes almost like an object, like a thick sense of soothing mm, beingness, presence, awareness. All right, that's the third type. So we've had penetrative, surrender, and then recognition or resting or abiding.